So in this part of the video, what I thought I'd do is I'd start with our spatula, some of our equipment, and an egg as the next part of the omelet. So what we do is we crack the egg like this, put it on the, put it on the frying pan like so, and then we turn up the heat. What you should start to notice is that as this is frying, it's going to, as it heats up, you're going to start to see a chemical change right about here, which is all the yolk here is going to start turning white. So as that starts to occur, we'll kind of get, we'll kind of get an idea of what's going on over there. Notice right over here, you can already start to see that reaction of the protein starting to turn um, from the egg, egg yolk being clear to white. That's showing the, you that it's heating up. What you might also start to see is that there's a little bit of smoke coming up, or at least steam, because now we're starting to get physical and possibly other chemical changes, especially right here, as the egg starts to brown. This is because I didn't put any oil on there to help keep the egg from sticking and burning onto the pan. So let's see what happens if I do this when I actually have oil on the, on the pan itself. As you can see, even the, the pan didn't, didn't do very well um, because there was no oil to work, work with this. So this time, what I did was I added some coconut oil to the, to the frying pan, as you can see. So now, when I crack my egg, put it on there, now it's sitting on the coconut oil itself. So let's see what happens when I start turning up the heat. My prediction is that at first, this coconut oil is going to start to go from white to clear because it's going to start to melt, or sorry, it's going to start to um, li liquefy, basically melt down into its um, into its more liquid state instead of this white part, which is more of the solid state. So that'll happen first as this as this frying pan area gets hot. Ah, and already right here, we can see some of the observations. Right over here, the eggs turn white really quickly, while this part didn't. It looks like this part of the coconut oil was much thicker than this part of the egg, so this, part, this egg cooked faster. What we conclude is that the egg, or something, the chemical reaction occurs faster when, when something, it, there's less of, less material to work with. So this egg, which was thinner, didn't have as much egg to cook, so it cooked faster than this part, than this coconut oil took to break down from solid into liquid. And as you can see, that reaction is starting to spread all over the place. The egg yolk, I mean, egg white is starting to actually turn white instead of, instead of simply clear. But you also notice that there's a little bit of bubbles. You can might see, be able to see some bubbles coming up from the, from the eggs. This is telling you that the eggs aren't simply burning because notice the last time they turned they were brown now they're just they're just white with with some they're white with some um brown without the brown 